guys, Ray with Paul Arena here. I'm live uh, at MWC 2012 and just wanted to use a bunch of uh, Nintel Power reference design smartphones here. So I'm inside a Intel booth. Go check it out. Alright, so uh, these devices are actually not on the market yet and it's not, uh, uh, not sure when they will come out. But I'll just show them on the video really quickly here. First of all, we have the Lenovo K800 smartphone, which is probably the closest one to a possible release, you know. The K800 powered by an Intel Atom processor C2460, an Android-based device, of course. Here it is. By the looks of it, it's uh, pretty snappy, although there is some choppiness with this custom interface. Seems to be running gingerbread right now. Uh, there are quite some personalizations made to it. And of course, the, the platform uh, shouldn't be ready uh, by now, so this might explain the, the subtle choppiness that we see here. Next up, we have this orange smartphone, again powered by that Atom processor C2460. Here it is, some kind of an orange smartphone. Probably this will be coming out with orange, you know, an Intel part smartphone for orange. Next up, we have this Solo uh, X900 Lava smartphone, by, uh, again powered by the same uh, Atom processor here. Here is it, the Solo. It's running some old version of uh, Android right now. Uh, it does run uh, snappier compared to the Lenovo that we saw here, the K800. Uh, not sure when this one comes out again. Of course, when it comes out, we expect that it will have ice cream sandwich or something like that. It's not, again, it's not the smoothest experience we've seen, but uh, it's still pretty decent. And last we have this Intel Smart and Reference design, which isn't something really new. It's right here, just a uh, random Android uh, smartphone, nothing special. Of course, the interesting thing about it is the Intel uh, processor. This processor, Atom processor, by the way, is a dual core. So Intel is yet to present us to a uh, quad-core solution. It is yet to present us to an to, uh, actual phone on the market. So this was it, a uh, brief hands-on look at uh, some new Intel Part smartphones probably coming out pretty soonish, but not sure exactly when. For more details on these uh, handsets and many others, check us out at phonearena.com.